very quickly away for the man going in late five, Eric Cray, the 28-year-old, but he's not going to be able to hold on here. It's on his outside jump on the 19-year-old. He's going to claim glory. He's going to go for gold. He's got the gold. This is just unbelievable. The 2016 Asian Junior Champion, 10-3-7. It's not his quickest time. He's nearly 0.2 of a second off his Malaysian record. He broke that record that had stood for over 20 years. He broke a 200 meter record that stood for over 49, but he's just stepped up as required, as expected, in front of his home fans and won the Blue Ribbon event as a teenager. He is Southeast Asia's fastest person and he's not yet 20. Well, Cray, in trying to dip for the gold, in trying to catch up, he might have even missed out on the silver. But spare a thought for Eric Cray. He's run four races in a day. And while he claimed the gold in the men's 400 meter hurdles, he was by two one hundredths of a second and he's missed out on the gold in the men's 100 final. Certainly not the quickest time. But there's absolute delight for the home fans. The 29th SEA Games being hosted in Malaysia by Kuala Lumpur. And a local lad has claimed the title. 10-3-4 in the semi-finals. 10-3-7 to win the gold. But very impressive for a man who was a junior, was expected to step up to the senior ranks. And he has done so in impressive fashion at these sea games in front of the partisan home support this is a goal that Malaysia will long celebrate well, being mobbed by photographers but Cray got off to a superb start but by the 20 meter mark it was already Harul Hafiz bin Jantam had it, uh, taken over the lead. Cray was always going to struggle. He's got four races in him today. The question is whether or not he actually got to the silver. In trying to dip for the line, he's completely lost it as well. I think he's only finished with the bronze. Kutsana Namsuan of Thailand looked to be the athlete who claimed the silver medal. And Cray will have to settle for the bronze. But just trying to dip, desperately lunging towards the line. Speaking of lunging though, an awkward fall for the young Malaysian. He's taken some skin off his elbow, but it won't detract from his celebrations.